Hey everyone and welcome back to the stream. It's been a while. Uh, just last Thursday we finally brought ourselves up to the seventh badge and uh, did some stuff on the islands as well. And now it's finally time to take on Giovanni in Pokemon Fire Red Randomized. Uh, I'm not sure if we'll have the same team he had in the uh, Rocket Headquarters, so we'll have to just see about that. Let's. Oh. Did you see that? For the briefest moment, OBS dropped a few frames there. Gotta be careful, that's not a good start. Anyway, let's get the preparing screen out of the way and continue exploring this gym. Let's see everything streaming correctly. Okay, yeah, I gotta keep an eye out on the bitrate, because even though I work hard to get everything in a stable state, it doesn't always stay that way. I don't know, I think substance is more important than style, cool trainer Warren. But if you have both, I guess that's some kind of mastery. Tail glow. That was cute. But ultimately a meaningless gesture. Nope. I think the rocks will serve as well here. Oh no, what a powerful attack. Another one? How many of those things have you got in your pocket, buddy? You, co you are collecting ladybugs. So I, this is a random anecdote, but I don't know what spurred it on, but at one point there was some sort of campaign against street violence in the Netherlands. Now we aren't exactly the uh, most criminal country, so I have no idea where that came from, but they represented the fight against needless violence with the uh, the ladybug that became a symbol of non-violence for them interesting isn't it because most people represent pacifism and similar lines of thought with a dove because after all the dove also represents peace so that kind of makes sense but why a ladybug it's a pretty it's a pretty insect but I have no idea if I e even said this before. I have a tendency to repeat myself. I have a tendency to repeat myself. Alright, that one's done. No problem whatsoever. Now, Pixel Master is clearly uh, a good match for this gym, but we also want to develop our other Pokémon as well, so... Alden is easily the lowest of us in terms of level, so we should build him up and Cuckoo House as well, and then continue on with Pixel Master. Oh, it's a fighting guy. <laughs> Your fate rests with me. That's an ominous thing to say to a kid you're about to fight. Takashi. We're about, uh, we're about to face Takashi's challenge, it would seem. Milk drink? Okay, Noctowl, you, uh, you do you. Can you imagine that? An owl with a big, big bottle of milk. Just drinking that stuff in the middle of battle. What is this, Winnie the Pooh? Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> it's just gonna keep doing this, isn't it? Just drink that milk. Gosh, I would sure like a crit right now. Maybe you should have just done this ball. I don't know. But wait, isn't Noctowl dark? Man, I'm supposed to know something about Gen 2 at least, but even that's... Uh, apparently too unfamiliar to me at this point. Oh wait, Ice is strong against Dragon, isn't it? Uh, I guess not. <laughs> or rather, Dragon isn't weak against Ice, at least. Anyway, I do appreciate how quickly Alden is leveling up. At this rate, we're gonna have him caught up with the rest in no time. So long as he doesn't get KO'd every two seconds, it's all fine. It's all good. I can't believe it's not Butterfree. Brands with names like that always crack me up. It's such an American thing to do. Having your slogan double as the title or name of the product. I don't... Okay then. Takashi is set and intent on not letting us through, so let's... <laughs> Briefly step outside and uh, take this opportunity to quickly stop by the Pokemon Center as well. Why not? Yeah, the past few days have been pretty busy for me. Uh, existing projects uh, coming to their climax, as it were, reaching the end. Uh, new products, products. Wow, products. Yes, that was what's their. That's what they're called. Both my spelling, pronunciation, and grammar is all uh, going to pieces at this point. Pokemon Fire Red randomized, more like the English language randomized. Alright, you just stay in place there, Karate Man. Is there anything interesting here? Nope. Just had to check. Curiosity and all that. So he is, so he is. Samuel. Samuel. Of course, a potion. But you've only bought time, and not much of it at all. Anyway, so yeah, busy days, busy days. Uh, that's why, uh, well, I've had, <laughs> I've had several rants about the length of the streams and such, so I won't go into another one, but... Uh, once things clear up a bit, it might be possible to do more and longer streams again. I I do miss those days of four-hour banjo e streams a bit, you know. When you stream for that long, it finally it fi finally starts to get a bit more chill. Like when I start out streaming, uh, every time I'm a bit nervous near the uh, near the start of it. It's just in my nature, I guess. It takes me a long, long time to actually uh, relax. 
Indian food just arrived within 10, uh, 10, 11 minutes of ordering. That's a new record. Nice! A new record! And welcome to the stream. And down it goes. Oh. Well, it's fine. It's fine. That's also fine, so long as it doesn't increase its special defense. Ah, you missed. And a crit too. Look at Alden taking names. I was trying to think of interesting food ordering uh, stories, but I don't actually order that much food. <laughs> uh, I once ordered stuff from a local Argentinian place, that was pretty cool. Took them a while to actually get the stuff here though, like 45 minutes or so. Ah, uh, I see. I'm not even sure if it is actually Argentinian, but we have several interesting restaurants. There's also a, uh, what do you call that country <laughs> in England? Surinamian? Sur Sur <laughs> so, there's a country that used to be part of the Netherlands, the Republic of Suriname. I'm not sure if you guys actually call it that, so I'm gonna check on Wikipedia like a scumbag. It is called Suriname or Surina... I don't know how you guys pronounce it. So I'll just call it Suriname. Whatever. Anyway, we have those restaurants as well. <laughs> Alright, that makes sense. Fridays are good days to order stuff on. Now adds a bit of celebration to that Friday uh, evening feel. But yeah, other days are fine as well. <laughs> By the way, are my uh, levels still okay in terms of the audio versus the game audio, stuff like that? Like I uh, keep complaining about <laughs> the microphone does shift around a bit. And you know how some software hijacks your microphone and all that. I don't mean like American Secret Service hijacking, I mean Skype demanding the use of your microphone. <laughs> and they are okay, thanks. Hmm. If there are more opportunities to catch uh, Pokemon, we should get you uh, a new Pokemon, Clive. We had Raven, but uh, she was a Lydian, and people were like, oh no, that is that is the worst Pokemon that has ever been cursed upon mankind. I think there's a, a, a trainer here. Yeah, there's no need to fight him, but... You crack off your whip. Wow, keep your whip to yourself, buddy. Cole, Tamer Cole. Now, I said it before, but this 
Pokemon, Xatu is so scary. Just look at it. Just look at the beady eyes. The way it stands there, kind of looking at you from the side. It's not. It's funny when it's a, a cute sprite on a bright background, but imagine running into that in a dark alleyway. Terrifying. Uh, that was pretty much the low-hanging fruit in terms of jokes for a guy with a whip. I don't know, there are other martial arts that would probably say the same. Well, more so the people practicing them than the actual arts themselves. But, you know what I mean. I like Murkrow's design. With that little witch hat. Finger wagging intensifies. I swear, sometimes I just win battles because the trainers make dumb choices, dumb decisions. We still have any potions? I keep running back to the Pokemon Center, but yeah, we have a few. Okay. Okay, let's head straight to Giovanni then. No need to delay. Alright, what do you have to say for yourself, Giovanni? Fwa ha ha ha. Welcome to my hideout. It shall be so until I can restore Team Rocket to its former glory. But you have found me again, so be it. This time, I'm not holding back. Once more, you shall face Giovanni, the greatest trainer. Eh. Level 45, that's actually a bit more than I expected. I'll, I'll help you glow. There you go. <laughs> Alright, let's give Kuklao some screen time. Good evening, back to murder. Good to see you. Welcome to the stream. Uh oh. So much for giving Kukwao some screen time. I guess this is just the way it had to be. That's awkward when you try to kiss someone and you miss. Apparently everyone's missing right now. Oh, come on.
It's fast asleep. I was actually looking up some of those uh, Pokemon Stadium voice clips. I am really impressed with just how many uh, clips they recorded for the announcer to say. Some of them actually make me chuckle. Like reactions to rare events, like he has a voice clip for when you splash. Or he's <laughs> like really exasperated, like what's the point of splashing? That's good. I, li I like that they did that. Wait a minute, level 50? What? Um, just pretend it didn't happen. This is not a level 50 Pokemon, it's actually level 40. We're fine. Just, uh, just knock it out like nothing's going on. You gonna stop using Hyper Potions, <laughs> Geofunny? Well, so much for that. Gligar, huh? Hmm, I wonder if we can call on uh, Kukwos now. Maybe he'll wake up. <laughs> I mean, he's a legendary, come on. He can't stay asleep for very long. Right? Do we have an awakening or something? Basically just spray him with water. I was about to say, don't you dare do the kiss again. Don't want a kiss from you. Oh. Well... Maybe we should have a different Pokemon out right now, after all. But at least we woke him up, and that's what matters. Let's bring out Heath then. Ow. <laughs> Stop it. His accuracy is already so bad. And there we go. That's what we needed. We can use the Poke Flute for free unlimited awakenings. Whoa, is that true? I never knew that. If they fall asleep again, we should do that. Alright, Kukwaus, come on. If you do this right, the finishing move is yours. Don't muck it up. Very good. Player defeated leader Giovanni. Wow, he's pretty cool about it. I like it. The first few times we defeated him, he was like, How dare you? But now he's, uh, he's pretty cool about the whole thing. Oh, he just leaves, huh? I forgot that he actually decides that that Team Rocket is over forever. But then they came back in the next game, so... Eating them slowpoke tails. Oh, 
Or mostly selling them, not eating them, but... Alright, well, that's eight badges in the bag. I was actually watching someone play a Nuzlocke of one of the newer Pokemon games. It's pretty funny. So he he, uh, he came across a Deoxys, I think, which is a legendary, if I understand it correctly. I keep pressing on the wrong. I keep being distracted and pressing on the wrong things in the menu. I never learn. Okay, we are headed in the right direction. Oh, there he is. What a surprise to see you here. So you're going to the Pokemon League, you collected all the badges too. That's cool. Well, there's this guy again. Oh my. I maybe should have done some leveling up before I went here. Ah, eh, who needs leveling? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Raise your stats all you like. Very nice. So yeah, we need to try to level everyone up to at least past level uh, 40. That's okay. Just throw rocks at it. Ow. But it's fine, because it's dead now. Kukwaz needs to be leveled up a bit too. Ah, uh, this should work, unless I've got my types mixed up again. Yeah, I got it right, okay. You could say, his bark was worse than his bite. I'm trying to remember what Opsol actually is. Oh no, it's a, it's a legendary, right? It's like a four... It's a quadruped. Yeah, with a hook eh, head. It's kind of scary looking. It's not a legendary? Oh, okay. Memento. That was a weird movie. My attack would also fall if I uh, watched that. It is a dark type Pokemon, I do know that. Oh no, actually, Hound Hour. Dark Fire? Or is it only Hound Doom? <laughs> I like that. Confetti.
for some reason it looked like a uh, legendary to me because it well it reminded me a bit of the legendary dogs and Jay and Raikou and such. Ah, there's Houndoom. Very scary looking. It is a pretty cool Pokemon, yeah. Eruption, okay. Have you ever seen a dog erupt? Maybe, maybe don't answer that question. <laughs> Rip. I wonder how much damage we can do. Uh, maybe we can try to paralyze it. Oh, nope. Going down. I hope this Houndoom won't be the death of, death of us. I think we have a few uh, revives though, so it's fine. Feather Dance? What's a, what's a Houndoom doing with Feather Dance? Okay, very good. All we need to do is, n is survive now. It should only have five eruptions uh, in it before it runs out of PP. Oh, there it goes again. Oh. That could have been worse, though. Thirty-two. I like how he loses, but he's still smug about it. What a guy, what a guy. <laughs> a level two mighty Hina. Let's catch it. No, uh... I think not. Let's see. Uh, we, you can still catch Pokemon on the road to the... Uh, I almost called them the Fantastic Four. To the Elite Four, right? I'm pretty sure there's some, some uh, caves and patches of grass on the way. Oh yeah, a whole 36 experience points. Delicious. So how's our team looking? Mm, now that Back to Murder is here, we also need to bring his Pokemon back, I suppose. And we need to catch a new one for Clive. Al almost at my PC again, almost. So, Pixel Master has served us Well, which of these Pokemon is best to get rid of at this point? If any, you know, if we had to get rid of one, ignoring the levels.
<laughs> Phil Swift. <clears throat> Okay, now that that's settled... Let's head over to the uh, Fantastic Four. <laughs> A level 3 Houndoom. Scary. Right, here we go. Go right ahead. I like how different segments of this path open up as you uh, have more badges. Very exciting. Rainbow badge. Alright, we're probably going to run into Pokemon on the water here. So let's uh, see if there's anything interesting to find. Combuscan. I think we already have one of those, so that's probably fine. Oh wait, isn't it flying? No, it's fire fight. No, fire. No. That fire monkey is fire... ...fighting. This one is fire fly flying, I think? Or not. Yeah, it's a pretty bad job. Standing there waiting for people with the right badges. I've never envied the whole concept of security guards, to be honest. I, uh, I appreciate the important work they do, but I could never do it. <laughs> Keeps accidentally going to shore, yeesh. Come on, more Pokemon, yeah? <laughs> Growlithe. Maybe uh, there will be better Pokemon further in. Screech. Ah oh, yeah, there's grass here. Jigglypuff level 34. Okay, we'll look around and see what we can encounter here. But... Do you want a Jigglypuff? A Jigglypuff. Jigglypuff named after you, uh, Clive. Oh, uh, well. Nice crit, Alden. You wrecking ball, you. Or a Dodrio.
Let's try the great balls first. Represent Joy, Sadness, and Anger, huh? <laughs> Triple bird Pokemon. Yeah, it's very cool. So do we name this one Clive or... We'll just name every Pokemon we catch here Clive. How about that? <laughs> uh, okay, maybe not this one. Let's see if there's anything else uh, to be found here, anything more interesting. Oh, hey! Smeargle! How about that one? It's level 40. This one is the most on the level with the rest of the team, so we could just put a few TMs on uh, on it and have a grand whole time. But is the catch rate really bad on Smeargle, Smeargle or am I just uh, unlucky? Don't make me use a Master Ball on this random encounter. Okay, good. Now this one is also going to be called Clive. All of them. I think there is like a Pokemon Center here near the end. It's kind of important. We need to want to heal before we actually go all the way. Are there any different Pokemon in this grass? Oh! Slacking. Slacking is a very high tier Pokemon, isn't it? It skips uh, every uh, other turn, which makes it slightly less good, but it has tons of health. Come on. You could make like a, an awkward montage of all the dumb things I've said while I try to persuade Pokemon to stay in the Pokeball. What do we call this guy? Because I think we've decided, well... Hmm. We've decided, hmm... 
top class commentary over here. Alright, and that's the last one, right? Victory Road. Croconaw. Yeah, I didn't really want to catch that anyway. I think we've already got what we need. Please. Oh, hey, Goldeen. Cross between a goldfish and a unicorn. It would be nice if that just activated automatically, but... I don't know what that did, but that seemed like the right thing to do. Whiskash. You gotta love that derpy look on its face. Oh, right, trainers. The moment when you meet someone and already they're asking those questions, <laughs> you're good enough. N Naomi with the high standards. Whoops. I didn't know he knew that one. Oh well. Is there any point to learning meditate at this point? Nah. Should be able to take this guy out in one go. Oh, well, I miscalculated slightly. Bye, Elden. Oh, actually. Hey, come on. Maybe I was thinking I could get an easy kill in for some bonus EXP, but... Come on, crit. Okay, I guess not. Gonna be making wishes again. Uh, I 
think I started on a tangent earlier and didn't finish it because that's apparently what I do every time. So I was talking about watching another stream with a Nuzlocke and Deoxys appeared and he was like, Oh, I'm gonna catch Deoxys. It's my favorite Pokemon. And uh, then it teleported away. <laughs> and in a Nuzlocke, the first Pokemon you encounter, you either catch it or you don't, but you don't get a second chance. So, yeah. That was a disappointment for him. I'm not sure if Deoxys is even supposed to have teleport. is relentless. I know this is a bad matchup, but I'm just stubbornly trying to get uh, <laughs> trying to get back to murder to level up. By the way, it's very hot. Oh, he was just leading me on. And he uses ancient power. Sneaky boy. Finally. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do the smart thing this time. He's back to murder out to get the experience, then switch. To I don't know. Huh? That was scary. <laughs> Rose is gonna go down at this rate. Haha! -ha! But it was not to be. I, pl I planned it perfectly. There was no guesswork, no risk taking. I knew exactly what would happen. There we go. Ah, this is a situation. This is a situation where we could really use back to murder. What with the uh, petal dance, you see. <laughs> I like that fighting pose, though. Water spout. Well, that did a lot more damage than I expected, to be honest. These moves, man. <laughs> this should take him out in one go. It's Vault Tackle, I mean, come on. There we go. Just as I expected. Am I good enough for you now, Naomi? Well, sometimes life is just like that. 
Alright, let's get these poor fainted Pokemon back up on their feet. Completely lost where I put the, uh, the water, but it's at the bottom, I think. Yeah. You don't need to do a whole animation every time I use it, game. I've never listened to this music for this long, so it's kinda. I don't think I've ever even heard this part. So slow, yes, exactly. Goldine, Goldine. Yeah, maybe I should have turned up the speed as well, but I want it to be a more organic experience, I guess you could call it. At least this guy isn't rude about it. Rolando. Rolando Bloom. Oh, I should have done this ball. Well, it doesn't make much of a difference in the end, but... Yeah, he raised his speed to be uh, able to do this nonsense. But, in the end, it doesn't even matter. We need to get Kukwaus up to level 40 ASAP. Come on, do that drill pack. There you go. Mm, let's put Alden back in. I don't think this will be an instant kill, but we can always see. It should do a lot, at least. Yeah, it's not its not even very different from uh, just using the Dragon Claw. It's all the same in the end. How many of those does he have in his pocket? Hmm. I always think like, oh, this won't be very effective, but then it still does a lot of damage. Oh. That's interesting. It almost never happens. Oh, but I can, I can see why he did it. He got me stuck in a pedal dance and then he switched to a fire Pokemon. Sneaky, sneaky. And now I'm stuck. Or not. <laughs> Alright, Heath, time to uh, crush this chicken. Oh dear, did the attack miss? Wasn't that a shame? Ah, eh, let's keep Heath out. Might as well. This one is already half dead. He isn't gonna make...
Welp. Oh, cross jump just cuts live in half? Is that how it works? I didn't even think about that. But... When I mean, you don't mash the button aggressively, it takes a long time. You're right though, yeah, it is very slow in general. Well, cool trainer. Not so cool anymore. Oh, hey, Latias. Good to see you here. Want slow play Diamond of Pearl. Are they that slow? I've heard some things about that gen, but I didn't know they were considered among the slower ones. And also, welcome to the stream. It's good to see you. Final test, huh? Platinum was sped up though, that makes sense. I'm glad they listened to the feedback so quickly then. Just learn fly. <laughs> Whoops. Now it's gonna hit me. Danger, high voltage. Actually, no, let's keep this one. This volt tackle should be a That could have been a lot scarier than it actually was. Drowsy. I should really heal my Pokemon now. Keep forgetting. Be gone from this house. Aromatherapy.
Come on, stop doing that. <laughs> Drowsy definitely look, doesn't look like it has the build to be agile. Might be a bit out of our league. <laughs> yeah, 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 Latios, we know. Guy's been stalking us for a while now. Come on! I don't really want to do a thorough exploration of this uh, particular cave right now. I mostly just want to move forward. But the encounter rate is quite high, it would seem. When I went to do the, uh, <laughs> the little animation, the whelp, animation as I call it this one no this one I accidentally turned on uh, Skype and noticed that people were asking me <laughs> all sorts of difficult questions so I may have to cut the stream short in a little bit like I wanted to at least make it to the elite four but you know how it is, life and work and all that good stuff. Yeah, it takes so long. There's a lot of different Pokemon here. Overheat. But yeah. <laughs> huh. He just won't leave us alone, will he? Our Latios is being stalked by another Latios. How about that? Oh, you can upgrade his strength? This cave is crap. Oh. 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 Well, thanks for watching, everybody. That was the uh, the stream for tonight. Yeah, so suddenly Mewtwo. So, some uh, some opinions from the chat. Should I use my Master Ball on this uh, this little guy? Right. Let's 
So the general consensus is that yes, we should use the Master Ball. Oh, whoops, stop it. <laughs> There's no need for that. Let me just be very sneaky and make a save state just in case. But yeah, let's do the Master Ball. Why not? What should we call this guy? <laughs> uh, let's just keep it Mewtwo for now. Ow. <laughs> I say ow, but it's really just another encounter. That spot I need to put it in. Um, not here. <laughs> not here, apparently. Okay, hi there, Mew3. Oh, hey, Clay doll. Yeah, true, we haven't quite leveled as much as we should, probably. Oh, hey, Giraffe Rig! I do remember that one. Cute front, scary backside. Let's not uh, make any weird interpretations about that. Oh, hey, Mewtwo. Oh, hi, Mark. Sandstorm. Alright, so I need to push that rock over here, maybe? I don't mind if people uh, very s give me very subtle hints as to how the heck I get out of here. Because the heat <laughs> isn't doing my concentration much good. Oh. Fast asleep. Oh, 
Okay, finally. <laughs> it's just gonna let me wonder. Oh no. <laughs> I definitely didn't just Google a Pokemon Stadium soundboard. Nope. Not like you can actually hear him <laughs> very well, though. Oh, hey, there goes the connection. Nice. Hey everyone, <laughs> welcome back to the stream. When I think about it, Beck would have been an equally valid choice here. Oh, great, paralysis. Connection started out perfectly stable for like uh, 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 for a whole hour at least. Then it started doing the thing again. Alright, let's defeat this guy and then I'll probably have to just stop the stream. If it's gonna also be unstable, next to all the uh, other stuff I still need to do, it might be better to uh, make it a short one this time and complete the victory road next time. It should be back now. That's that. Um, hmm. There's Giraffe Rig again. Right, that's nice, but oh hey, Curlia, cute. We still keep running into new ones, though. Dust stocks. I don't think we ran into that one in this area. Oh man. These encounters are driving me crazy. I'm practically wheezing over here. One of these guys again. Pokemaniac. And down it goes.
Ah, uh, now we can't switch anymore. Uh oh. I completely forgot what a marsh stomp even was, not gonna lie. I thought it, uh, would bite, I just judged by the name and figured it was a grass type Pokemon. <laughs> Not that it matters because Sacred Fire turns everything into ash. Not Ketchum, but the, uh, the, the stuff. <laughs> yeah, you, you know what I mean. <laughs> Can't believe I was about to explain what ash is. So you know you're desperate for things to talk about. Hey, Sharknado. Can't escape. Hey, you know what would be fun? If not only you got dozens of random encounters, but you failed to escape from them. Sounds like good design. No, I'm not salty. You're salty. For upcoming streamable games, oh yeesh, I, uh, I've got a few possibilities. Uh, I think Tax suggested Ape Escape. Um, Meme Lord, who knows where that guy is, uh, he suggested that we... These encounters, man. He suggested that we either do Ratchet and Clank or uh, Jack and Dexter, which are... PlayStation platformers, so we could do those. Um, there's also the possibility of trying a few. Uh, nice, trying a few other Pokemon hacks. Maybe doing a, a Nuzlocke of this same game. No, those are all possibilities. What the? What is that? And more importantly, why is that? Well, we called it, whatever it is. There we go. Oh, here's the way out. Uh, we'll have to tech try it again next time. At least we finished the gym, but yeah. 
Unfortunately, work calls. Let's uh, take a brief step outside here. Okay, there we go. Let's call it a stream for now. Because the connection is being its usual useless self and uh, work and all that. Too many circumstances working against me. But we got uh, one, uh, one and a half hour stream in. We beat Giovanni. Uh, we're on the victory road and next time we're gonna complete it and hopefully uh, face the Elite Four as well. So thanks for visiting the stream everyone and I hope you'll join me next time. And sorry for the, the drops and the, uh, the short duration. But it is what it is. Hey, I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.